hi guys welcome back to my channel hope you guys are doing wonderful today i'm finally going to do my entire fragrance collection so grab a snack grab a drink it might be a while now i'm not going to go through notes and all that i'm just going to show you what i have so if you're interested to see what i have in my collection for now because this collection changes weekly <laughs> so if you're interested in this please stay tuned guys let's start with the first shelf so over here we have i might be a little bit shaky because i'm using my hands so right here we have my bonds at the back we have uh madison square park yeah that was a tester so i did not get the cap and it drives me insane and we have uh, bond number nine here, New York Nights. This was a recent acquisition. Very nice gourmand. This is uh, the signature scent. Beautiful, beautiful, classy fragrance. And we have scent of peace. Nice summer freshie. Over here, we have all of my... How, not how far to my pen, Halligans. Here we have Bewitching Yasmin. This was the first ever pen Halligans I got. Very nice uh, longevity, deep fragrance, beautiful jasmine, jasmine, sorry, bewitching jasmine. Then we have clandestine Clara and we have changing constant. This is from the portraits collection. Here we have how fatty cedar, how fatty leather and how fatty the original. Beautiful fragrances. I am so happy to have these in my collection, guys. They're beautiful. And here we have Irish Prima. It's a nice floral with a leather base. Sorry, my hands are blocking. Then we have um, Equinox Bloom, a nice floral. Over here we have Patchouli Arden and Santel Royal. This is all from the Guerlain. Here we have Azura from the Attar collection and Rose Omadia. Oh my god guys look at this look at this look how beautiful this is yes so this is rose omaria and we have al harmin genou noir so that's the top shelf so this shelf here i have my perfume damarly and my initial so to the back we have um darcy safanad beautiful delina and one of my newest acquisitions um Cassily nice peach well not i don't think it has peach in it but it's a nice floral scent this is more warm this is classy and then next shelf we have ojan by perfumes de marley a beautiful gourmand then we have herod i have um what's it there's another one but i have that in a gift set so it really couldn't fit here so i didn't put that one then we have the stunning stunning Food for greatness and then we have atomic rose and this one is absolute aphrodisiac this is really nice and we have we have this is a really really nice spicy one then over here we have blessed baraka and my one and only side effects okay side effects my beautiful side effect this is the one that started my journey with uh initio so this is my second shelf right here going down we have this other shelf here let me give you a little further view we have um carla barcelona tardes we have th um the uh, georgia armani the privé we have pavon Sazu. We have um, Vert Malachi. This is really nice. I bought this one before I bought uh, Rouge Malachi. Then we have uh, Rose de Arby. We have Jasmine Wisp and Frank Oliver Oud Vanilla in the back. To the front here, we have 1899. This is by Histress de Parfum. Guys, this reminds me so much of this one in the dry down. So yeah, if you're looking for a well, I wouldn't say it's a dupe, but it's very similar to Rehab. So that's that. We have Kerosene, Unknown Pleasures, Amouage, um, Honor, Nishane, we have Annie, we have Zane, and we have Hasivat. I have some more that I want to get, but it's not here as yet. Then we have Royal Elixir by Oman Jane. Gorgeous, gorgeous fragrance. 
this is a very unique fragrance it's by Como de Garçons and it's Clash Chlorophyll Gardenia really nice green earthy kind of gardenia this one here we have Miclef and this one is um, Mon Cristal I think I can't yeah I think that's it yeah very sweet fragrance and then we have my Byredo Mojave Ghost gorgeous one for the spring summer black saffron deep dark and sexy we have my one and only cupcake uh love is in the air and we have let me turn it around baradona yeah baraonda whatever yeah so that's that so that's my third shelf going down we have my designers down here so look how pretty these are these are really nice so let's start here we have hot couture by Givenchy. We also have uh, Kenzo Flower, JLo, what is that one? JLo Glow? I, don't, um, I can't remember. Glow by JLo, I think it's called. Then my favorite Isimiyaki Nectar. And this is another, uh, this one is Rose and Rose. That one is nice, but it's not as good as this one. I love this one. And then we have beautiful La Belle Dancing Roses by Victor and Rolf. That's, um, Alien, I'm not alien, Mugler, uh, Womanity, and there we have, um, uh, what's it called? Scandal by Night. Coming over here, we have my C. We have C, just the original C and C Passion. I really want to get C Fiori. Then we have uh, Fleur Muse by Narciso Rodriguez. It's a really nice rose. Then another rose fragrance here by Nina Ricci. And we have my stars. Ooh, look how pretty they are. Guys, we have, this is the Ocrosia. Yeah, this is from last year. This is the 2020 version. And this one here is the 2019 version. And then we have uh, Nova. And this is the Toilette version of Angel. So yeah, those are my stars there. Coming down, we have Alien. Alien Essence Absolute, one of my faves. Dolce and Gabbana Garden. Guys, that's a beautiful tropical fragrance and it lasts so long. Then we have YSL um, Libre, Lib, Libre, I don't know. Balenciaga, Flora Botanica. My gorgeous Versace Crystal. And Miss Dior, blooming, absolutely blooming. Coming down here, we have some of my angel, uh, my angels but i have a stand for this one but i don't have one for this so it was looking kind of lopsided so i just put them down here so we have the angel muse and the twilight version so winter summer then we have here kenzo world power i, I bought that one last year it's really nice for the summer we have isa by um who's, who's yeah and fresh uh, Cannabis Santal. Really nice fragrances. So this is my one, two, three, fourth shelf. Yeah, this is my town Ford shelf. Okay. Now everything has its house for now, but as my collection grows, trust me, it's not gonna be so separated because I may run out of space again. And I'm not gonna buy more shelves, okay? So we have our town fours here. We have Big Daddy bottle of tobacco for knee. We have um Noir, Tom Ford Noir. I just bought this one, um, Jasmine Rouge. So you probably see that. You'll be seeing some here that would be in uh, hauls coming up, but I had to put them on the shelf because they look so pretty. So yeah. We have Noir de Noir. Uh, we have Orchid Soleil. This is really nice. And we have Oud Mineral in another big bottle. Then we have a beautiful black orchid, of course. Love her. Oud Wood. That's a really good one as well. Shanghai Lily. I think that's when this continued. We have uh, Ombre Leather. Soleil Blanc, the toilet version. And we have the perfume version here, Soleil Blanc. And Rose Prick. So that's my Tom Ford shelf right here. So guys, welcome to my favorite shelf. <laughs> this is my Killian shelf, okay guys? Let's see what I have here. Well. First of all, to the back, I have a travel set with all 
the fragrance. Well, not all. There's a bunch of fragrances that I don't have in full sizes. So that's the travel set behind. We have over here, we have Intoxicated. This one, I could not find it here in Canada in a regular bottle. So this one is Laison Dangerous. It's really nice. It's a nice peachy fragrance. So I have this in a spray bottle that I use. And this is a 50 ml. It looks small, but it's 50 ml. Over here, we have another atomizer with some travel spray. We have gorgeous Angel Sheer. Okay, and the tray here we have, the back here we have Forbidden Games. We have Playing with the Devil. Focus camera, focus. We have Love, Don't Be Shy. And we have Black Phantom. To the front we have Good Girl Gone Bad. Back to Black and love extreme to the side here we have a woman in gold and i also have woman in gold in a refill bottle so a bunch of these i have in refill bottles as well forbidden games this one love don't be shy so i have backups of them because these bottles are refill so i do that and then we have from this other collection from killian i just have princess for now because i don't really fancy the others so yeah so this is my killian shelf beautiful Killian. I have all my Manceras and my Montals. I have quite a few Mancera and some Montals. Okay, to the back we have Black Vanilla, we have Velvet Vanilla, we have, what is this? This is Wild Candy, um, Old Orchid. Over here we have Instant Crush, Juicy Flowers, Holidays, wild fruits and roses vanille to the front we have this bad boy here red tobacco and this one is wild python and sicily guys this i think is my favorite favorite mancera sicily is stunning for the summer uh spring months then we have old blue notes this is my only tiny bottle then Mancera's here. We have Oud Amazing. We have um, Honey Oud. Yeah, this one is Honey Oud. And we have Sensual Instinct. This one is Starry Nights. Intense Cafe. This was the first one I ever got. And this here is a nice Oud. It's White Oud and Sweet Peony. So that's my shelf for my Mancera's and Montau. So over here I have another designer shelf. These are all my designers. To the back we have Idol, the, in, the regular and the intense. We have Good Girl Gone Bad, Legere and the original. We have Isimi, uh, not Isimiyaki, what is it called? Uh, Perry Ellis, the original. We have Mercedes Black and Kim Kardashian, um, Crystal Gardenia. I had to like chuck it to the wall to get it to stand. Over here we have the three Dolce and Gabbana one and only, the three flankers. So the original, one and only, intense, and the red one. Then we have um, Hermes Un Jardin Sunil. That's a really nice green, fresh, summery fragrance. We have an Erin here. It's um, Mediterranean Honeysuckle. My favorite one, Gucci Guilty Absolute. Compliment getter. I have uh, Dolce and Gabbana light blue, but the intense. I don't like the original version, so that's the intense. Another Erin Hibiscus Palm. That's this one is a powerhouse. To me, it lasts really long. When I overspray, I get a headache. This is a nice fresh summer scent. It's specific line, really, really fresh and pretty. And here we have uh, another Lancome, and it's Trissel Midnight Rose. Beautiful fragrance. Next shelf we have Wanted. Um, this one is D Squad. Guys, this came <laughs> this came with this ugly cover that I do not like. So I took it off and I put this because that's so obnoxious. So I just put that there. As I said, this is a new one I just got. Some of these you're gonna see in our upcoming haul, but I, I as soon as I get them, I just put them on my shelf. So yeah, so that's this is a nice sweet fragrance. It reminds me of Miclef uh Mon Crystal. And these are the three Montpari, the three flankers. I can't remember what they're called, honestly. But yeah, this is the original, this is a flanker, and this is a flanker. So yeah. 
I have Ellie Sab. Now, I have been talking about this. Guys, I have been talking about this since the beginning of last year, and I now see it getting some hype. This is a very classy, elegant fragrance. I really like it. This is the only Ellie Sab I have from this uh, line. So yeah, I really enjoy that. Then we have this little... What is it called? This is Lolita Lampica. The little apple. I just find it's cute. I haven't worn it in a while, but it's a very unique scent. We have Hypnotic Poison and Ellie Sab Girl of Now. Guys, I just have this big Kenzo flower. This is Elixir. Oh my god, I have nowhere to really fit it in. So it's just kind of clumsy, obnoxious standing there. So I just kind of put it to the side. So ignore that, okay? Then we have Amour by Amour Amour. Guys, this is an old one, but I really enjoy the scent. I remember smelling this on somebody and I'm like, what are you wearing? And she said, it's the cheap, you know, this one. And I'm like, I like it. So I went and I got it. It's really pretty. And then we have Gucci, uh, Gucci Perfume 2, Gucci 2. I think this is discontinued, but this is a nice fresh year and it lasts pretty good. Guys, this is the original Chloe. I really enjoy Chloe. It's such a pretty girly scent. Here we have Flora by Gucci. This, as I said, is the perfume version I have. And then we have La Nuit Tresor. This little one here. This smells really good. So yeah, so this is my shelf of another... This is my another designer Next shelf that I have. This shelf right here. Another pretty shelf. So we have my Vicantos to the back. We have Magnificat, Mirabelle, and Mag Mandagolia. So that's my Vicanto. Down here we have my Tiziana Terenzi, Andromeda, uh, Spiritio Ferentino, Tabit, and Draco. Going to the back here, I have some Mason Margiela. We have Jazz Club, uh, Fireplace by the Fireplace, and Music Festival. Down here we have Mula Mula, the original Mula Mula Extreme, and The Chronic by Byron Perfumes. Really nice. And my front shelf, guys, we have my Mason Francisco John. So we have Boot Satin Mood, Gentle Fluidity Gold, Gentle Fluidity Silver, Black Rat Rouge 540, and Grand Soir. And guys, you'll see this in an upcoming haul. I just received this bottle. I bought this and it's stunning. I don't think the camera could pick up how beautiful that is and it smells freaking amazing so yeah that's the other top shelf here so this is how the top shelf goes it goes around and there come back down so my second shelf on this side i have all my um lancome um what is this mason lancome so we have jasmine mazapan Oud, no, Oud Ambrosia, Ambrosi, I don't know, I say Oud Ambrosia, and we have Roses Barbaranza, Lavin, Lavin Tres, Tres Trignon, <laughs> yeah, this is the discontinued one, then we have Tuberos Castine, so that's my Mason Lancome top version, then we have here, um, Swiss Arabian, that's, um, what is it called again? Oh my lord, I forgot. Shagaf Oud. My bad. If I turn it to the front, maybe I'll see. Duh. Then we have Oud Bouquet here. Oh yeah, this is another one from up here. But the bottle was smaller, so... Yeah, no. You know how it goes. So yeah, that's that. Then we have Noble 1942. And it's La Danza de la Luba Luba. <laughs> yeah. And then we have from Versailles, we have Tisandu over here. Now I have my BDKs here. Um, I have Rouge Smoking, Grey Chanel, and Tobacco Rose. So that's what I have there. Coming forward, I have Tuxedo by YSL. This is the, um, the private line, I think. Then we have Imaginary Otters, and this is uh, Memories of a Trespass. <laughs> yeah, okay. Girl don't have on her glasses, okay? Then we have all her main. This is um, Amber Oud. Smells so good. That is a beast, okay? Then we have my Kealis here. So we have Vanilla. We have Deja Vu. And we have the Elixir. So that's that shelf. Okay? Coming down here. I have... 
to the back, I have Fab Delicious by Christian Dior, Serge Luton Umbois Veni, African Leather by Mimo. Oh my god, so good! Tamarindo as well, amazing by Mimo. Then we have some Zojov here, we have the Cosmorati line, I have Lira, and I have Bouquet Ideal. Coming down, another Zojov, I have Naxos. This is a new one you'll see up coming in a haul. I'll tell you some more about it. This one is Overchair. We have Golden Dollar. Uh, Le Labo Noir 29. And over here we have some Diptyque Eau Dwell. Um, this is Oud Pilau, a new one that I got. Ellie Sub here, Essence Number 3, Amber. And one of my favorites, my staple, Creed Aventus for her. Coming down here, we have my Navitas perfumes. I have Exalt Nui and Idola. I have, um, this is uh, Galaga Fragrances, Rosé All Day. And this is by Amav and it's Club Nui Intense. It's like a dupe for one of the Tom Fords. Then I have my one and only egg. I hope to add some more. This is Golden Power by house of oud and i have my two clive christian here i have e clive um this is e and this one is nine i'm um, 1872 i can't even read here we go so yeah those are my two so that's this shelf right here coming down here this is another designer shelf so i have my designer shelves going straight across to the bottom here so yeah so I try to take everything from my other shelves and I try to pack it here. So as my collection grow, you might see things moving around. I might have to take back stuff to the other cupboard, but we'll see how it goes. So here we have Marc Jacobs um, Decadence. That's the original Decadence. I love it. Then we have Kenzo Jungle Elephant. I'm missing the cap because it was a tester. And we have my, one of my favorites, Gucci Rush. That's the original. Then we have some... Takaroban here. This one is Olympia. So this is Olymp the original and this is the intense. Then we have Chanel Chance or Fresh. And some more Chance here. We have the original Chanel Chance. Such a classy fragrance. And this is Chanel Etendre. So we have Flower Bomb. I think this is Extreme or Intense or something. But I think that's in Discontinued. And this is the original Flower Bomb. We have Chloe Nomad. One of my favorites here, Aqua di Gioia by uh, Giorgio Armani. We have Versace here. Coming down here, we have my Burberry Blush and my Burberry Black. Really nice. Narciso, this is Narciso Poudre and this is Narciso Ombre. This one came out last year. Guys, this is a really nice Bulgari. This is Bulgari uh, Rose Essential. So, so pretty. So, yeah. This is, um, what's this other one? Because of You by Giorgio. Is it Giorgio Armani or Giorgio? Something. Something Armani. We have uh, Versace Eros. That's really good too. And we have Coco Chanel. Coco Mademoiselle. That's the intense version. Coming forward, we have all my Nest fragrances here. We have Indigo. We have Coco Woods. Dahlia Divine, Dahlia and Vines, and Wild Poppy. Over here, we have a nice freshie from Ite La Orange. I don't know how to pronounce that. You or someone like you. Really nice, fresh, minty fragrance. Then over here, we have one from Floral Street, and this is Neon Rose. This is my Bulgari. Oh my God, what's it called? Oh, I can't remember the name. This one is Coral. Coral, my bad. It's Coral. So yeah, so that's that, and this line. So guys, I have some more in some other shelves, in some other trays, so I'll show you guys that next. So yeah, so this is my perfume collection that in this uh, shelving. This little MFK travel set here as well. This one is, uh, there's one for him or one for her? This is the one for him. Yeah, so it has a bunch of, sorry, the lights, a bunch of fragrances that I could try. So yeah, that's my little MFK thing. So guys, this is another little tray that I have in my room. It's like easy reach, out of the shower kind of fragrances. So yeah, so here I have my Casablanca. 
I have my bum bum sprays, my YFL Sadiq and Voltaire. This is her. That's my like my one of my favorites to go to bed. It's really nice. This and guys, I made a really good dent on this one. I have uh, Armani Code. I think this is discontinued. I have my YSL here. Black Opium. Guys, this one is so pretty. It's such a lovely bedtime scent. Every time I wear, wear this to go to bed, my husband loves it. Here we have some Jo Malone's. This is um, Jasmine Sandback. I have Blackberry and Bay. I have um, Wood Sage and Sea Salt. This one is uh, English Oak and Hazelnut. I have another one with English Oak and something is probably down uh, in my other uh, cabinet. This we have the Dua, the uh, the Encounters collection. Romantic for him and romantic for her. These are pretty nice. Here we have uh, Chloe Love Story. Guys, this is such a beautiful feminine scent. It's very feminine, pretty. Here we have my uh, Tiffany vanilla woods guys zara orchid guys you need to get onto this this is such a pretty i forgot to put this in my lineup this is such a pretty springtime fragrance spring summer guys i've put on so many people to this because when they smell it on me they they ask what i'm wearing and they fall in love i put on a lot of people to that fragrance it's really pretty this here we have uh mon girl uh, Banana Republic, Tobacco and Tonka Bean, and um, what's it called? Ammo. Over here, I just have some of my duas. I don't really have a house for them, it's just in my old cupboard here. We have Cherry Casino, Love Bound, Absolute, uh, no, Aphrodisia Cafe, Rose's Thorn, um, Caribbean Casino, Caribbean Waters, and Caramel Delight. Sorry about the lighting, it keeps cutting off. I have that sensor light here. So these are my do a bunch of travel size stuff here. A whole bunch of uh, travel fragrances here. So yeah. So that's some of my stuff in travel spray. Guys, here I have some more travel spray. Some of them are decants. So yeah, that's that. And then I have some more travel sprays in my customized cup. Isn't it so cute? So thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for staying to the end. I hope you enjoyed my video. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Please share this video with a friend. And until next video, guys, be safe, be kind, and smell fabulous. Bye now.